It's a good thing I'm not the president. I'm an independent because I would prosecute the people who did it. I would prosecute the people who ordered it, and they would all go to jail. Uh oh. The governor, Jesse Ventura, isn't known for holding back in his latest book, Don't Start the Revolution Without Me, out in paperback now. And Brian, uh, I don't know, do you even want to go face to face with the governor again today? Uh, well, no, I'm just you saying. Face off. No, I watched the governor, I watched you on Hannity last night a few hours ago. You just finished up. You are so down on what the administration did between 2001 and 2007. That's right. Why? Why? Because that we now torture and waterboarding. I've been waterboarded, it is torture. I can speak from experience. It was part of SEER training that I went through as a Navy SEAL. And are you okay now? I'm fine. So, so is Khalid Sheikh Mohammed. He's about 60 pounds overweight, having it, a great it, time. It doesn't matter. If, if it was okay, then why don't we do it to criminals? When, like, if we've got gang members in L.A., okay, we know that their gangs are going to do bad things. When we arrest them, why don't we waterboard them so we can get information out of them? Do you want to stop because it's against attack? the law. Do don't it. come after me with that nonsense. What's nonsense? Waterboarding, about it? because number one. If you torture someone, what you get is baloney. Well, it turns because, out no. they feel differently. The CIA feels differently than you do. If you read the 175 pages, they talk about we got this guy, we get Humbali, we get his brother, and it happened by the corroborating all this different evidence from the material they got. And they only waterboarded three guys. And on top of that, I want to know how you feel about the light deprivation, when you talk about uh, not uh, sleep deprivation, when you talk about hot cold, when you talk about bugs. Does that all bother you? Yeah. Why don't, we, why don't we do that with our people in prison and jail? Mm -hmm. Ticking but, time bomb. So how else should we find out information from these terrorists? Well, you find out information uh, like these guys. They, let, they, they got more information from them. It's documented before they ever waterboarded them. I find it in okay. Why didn't we the water? FBI wait, I says that the CIA doesn't. You wait, wait. Why don't out. we? Why didn't we waterboard McVeigh and Nichols then? The there US were more them. people. There were more people that they thought involved in Oklahoma City. Why weren't they waterboarded to get information? Because it's against the law. What you, and, and if we're not going to wait, if we're not going to be law? a country, if we're not going to be a country that goes by the rule of law when it's convenient or inconvenient, then what do we what stand for? What country do we have if we're all on fire? If buildings are blowing up? If people are jumping out of skyscrapers? Do you want to live in that country? That you live? In, if you worked in the CIA, you wouldn't do everything you can to keep those people safe? I wouldn't torture. But what about the difference between you bring up Timothy McVeigh and gang members, and maybe those threats weren't as imminent? As the threat I don't think these threats back. are imminent. You didn't think after 9-11 that, that America felt that the threats were imminent, that more could be coming? Maybe, but I think our behavior has caused us to be in more trouble. Now, they won't release these photos. Why? Because they know the Muslim world will go irate. They're all after Nancy Pelosi. When did she know? When da da da? Well, if we hadn't have tortured, it'd be a dead issue, wouldn't it? It's not, Let's go to the real torture. issue. It's called you, it's it's enhanced tor interrogation. Because Dick Cheney makes up a no, new word. No, but the CIA told him that word. That's say, we need to get enhanced Mama, interrogation. Abu, Abu it's, it's torture, my friend. Well, and, that, and I've and, had it done. Have you been waterboarded? What? Do you want have me you to? Been water yeah, no, get waterboarded. No, and then we'll ask you. Yeah, well, Let me waterboard you. I'm not blowing you. up America. I'm not trying to destroy this country. I'm not trying to fight against democracy everywhere we go. These people Neither are, the, are they. These are the people that cut off Danny Pearl's head, and you're worried about their welfare. No, I'm not worried about their welfare. I'm worried about what our country them, stands for. Are you afraid for. of getting them radical? I'm You're worried about what this defense? our country... Well, where's it going to end? We have to end where is it gonna when end? they're dead. Really? Yeah. What, well, how when Al-Qaeda loses, have when you they enlisted? decided their philosophy... Have you enlisted or are you just talking? No, am I just talking? You want me to enlist? Yeah. You don't like our armed forces? Go walk the walk. You, don't talk to talk. So wait a second. So if I'm not in the military, I can't pull for America? Sure you can. Yeah, and I can't but fight don't for tell, America? But you, you, don't, you ain't right. fighting for All right. us. Yes. While they continue to battle it out, we're going to take military. a quick break. We'll be right back.